Psalm 36, you read here something that David often says, that he and the faithful take refuge under the shadow of your wings. In those days, there was the ark, which was like a box. And inside it, there was the tables of the, co the, tables of the covenant. And on top of it, there were the cherubim. And once a year, the high priest would throw the blood of atonement onto the top of the box, the top of the ark, and the lid of the ark was called the mercy seat. And between the wings of the cherubim, over the blood that was thrown there once a year, there shone the glory of God Almighty. This was in the most holy place. And the high priest of Israel could only go in there nervously once a year. Well, when David was on the run from Saul, he couldn't go to the tabernacle, to the tent of meeting where the, the ark was kept. He couldn't go there because he was on the run from Saul and his enemies and later from Absalom. And yet he says that he feels that he has come to live under the shadow of your wings, that he lived, as it were, there over the blood of the covenant with the glory of God all about him. You see then the difference between religion and spirituality. He was driven out of religious structures, but he came to the very most holy and intimate place of God's presence, which is having him and his spirit in your heart, in your life. So don't be fooled by religious structure. If you're cast out of it, take that as a blessing, because this is what happened to David, but it can lead you to that intimacy with God where you dwell under the shadow of his wings, on the mercy seat, over the blood of atonement, with the glory of God Almighty all around you. And if you are in the religious structures, don't be lulled into a sense that this is all there is. This is a surface level experience that you're having. This is the necessary religious structure of where you are, and how you are, but there is a lot more to it than that. Outside of that, the pattern of going to meetings, etc., there is this intimacy with Yahweh, God of Israel, himself, over the blood of atonement, with the angel wings all over you, uh, all around you, and his glory itself.